Hello everybody, welcome back to EO4 and Paradox Game of Playing. And we're about to finish the war with Morocco. Now the only <clears throat> the only vassal I would be able to release is Schlemsen. I could even give them some more land, but I'm just gonna actually take this. Do I wanna go down here? This is a lot of land. And it's gonna cost me admin points to core it. I really want to get to the next idea. So based on that, I'm gonna restrain myself from taking much this time. Just taking this. All their money. Uh, war reparations. I could release Algiers, but uh, they will also be Sunni. Same goes for Tunis. So that's not really on the table, I think. On the other hand, that would stir up some noise over there. And in any case, it would weaken Morocco. Yeah, let's uh, get Tunis out. There we go. And then release Chlemsen. With their one province as a vassal. And then we will make them Ibadi, because they're not Ibadi, they're Sunni. So we'll make them a body. There we go. Right, let's come down with these guys. And we'll core up these two. Why can't I core up Twat when I can core up this one? Because it's next to my vassal. Okay. All yeah, right. Um, then we need to get these guys to like me. So royal marriage. Also up here we have some Ottoman rebels that we need to deal with. Well, let's go deal with them. And did they turn Ibadi? They should. Yes, but the province is still Sunni. Oh, but they're converting. Oh, that's very nice. So I can feed them all the stuff up here. And hopefully Tunis will stir up some trouble. Another thing I noticed is that Edirn has been uh, converted. So... Apparently Serbia is converting. And I just need to deal with this 37 stack. Let's just wait for my troops to come down. And I think, uh, yeah, I need to go and occupy this stuff. The Ottomans are pretty much still alive. Now the bad thing I also noticed is that Brunei is now colonizing like madmen. Well, they're colonizing this one. 
That will make it Sunni, of course. This is Portugal. And they're still allied with France. And I can't attack them because I'm in a Regency Council. Okay, let's see. They're down here now. Gained a core. Let's get that one back. I don't know if we need reinforcements in there. No, we're okay. All right. Let's get these guys um, east, I think. I oh, still have the Ottoman separatists in Isel and Teke. All right, let's just stay there. We can't attack anybody anyway. We got that done. Okay, so bu -bu -bu -bum. I got free diplomats, let's use them. Now these are all Sunni. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Why do I want to put more claims? Persia. And what else? These are all reverting back to the Ottomans, which is okay because. Genoa is not able to um, convert anyway, so it's better that way. It's impossible to keep the Ottomans down. Claims, claims, yeah, I need claims on uh, Brunei. Alright. So the Regency is over in one year, and then I'll get a 015 leader, which is crap. Gain 25 admin, lose some money, and everybody becomes happy. Or gain piety and lose some money. So what do I want? Piety? I can always gain some more piety, so I think I want, I want to go for the admin. It's only 25 admin though. The piety means that I can get back to 70. I'll take the piety and then I should be able to convert again. At least with some No oh, mission. Turn Bangkok into a city. That is gonna happen sooner or later. Game one base tax. Morocco is no longer a rival. All right, who's the next target? Once I get out of, I think Multan. Multan still allied with Russia. And Abdin Nagar. Yeah, let's move. I oh, know they got troops of. Uh, are they? S yeah, they are heading that way. Uh, truce with Ottomans is still long. Nine years. Yeah, we should definitely hit 
somebody over here now. Come over that way. Now we got plenty of troops in here, so let's get one of them out. Come over here. I still got 80% on the Ottoman separatists though. So they are probably gonna pop very soon. And if they are, I should stick around with my army. Internal conflicts in Bukhara. Yeah, Bukhara is not a thing anymore. It never really was. Influx of unbelievers, gain piety, thank you. Back to 95 piety. Nice. And I think I can almost... Yeah, I can get it now. And I only have one core to go, so uh, let's go and grab this Divine Supremacy Missionary Strength plus three. That will help out immensely. That was a goal of mine to get that. Gain stability, nice. Back to plus three. And the king is of age, it's 0, 1, 5. So we got plenty of military points. 8, 5, 9. I still need more admin points. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna stick with the missionary strength no matter what. Yeah, so we should be able to keep up in military tech still. And do I have an error? Not yet, no. But that means we can now attack somebody again. Like these guys, for example. Which I can feed to Yao. Problem with Yao is they're never, ever gonna um, convert these two provinces. So I think I'm gonna have to take that from them. I think that is possible. What are the names? Aspen and... Ten ray. Uh, seize territory. Aspen. And seize territory. Ten ray. And then I'm gonna convert that for them. I can just give it back to them after that. Because I have no intention of coring it. Actually, we should get right on that, shouldn't we? Yeah, just cancel this one. Cancel this one. And then go for Aspen and Teneri. Convert those two. Now come down this way. And we'll attack uh, Katsina. Should still have a claim here, yes. An educated great sultan. Yes! That was the event I got before. So now I ha he's got two admin. 215. Back to 1059. Brilliant. Now I need to get relations up with Schlemsen. So let's do that. I should get Central Sahara soon. Get like I have most of the territory. Katsina is allied with nobody, so we can just move right in. Except I have no diplomat. Uh, I'll have in 30 days. Got a claim on Brunei. 
As soon as I get an opportunity to, to attack them, I will. Well, let's see actually now. Will France join them? Yes, plus 24. And they're not allied to anybody else. It's not the end of the world with France, but I just wanna... I would like to attack them without them. Be easier. So let's attack these guys instead. Show superiority. I have a general, so use him. Come in that way, come in that way. Truce expire with Persia. Really? That was quick. Uh, I have troops on the way here, and I have the big stack that's waiting for the Ottoman separatists to pop. They are at 90%. Once we finish off the Ottoman separatists, then we can start the war with Persia. Persia is allied with Jampur and Mivar. I don't think they can get through Multan. So let's continue with this war down here. It's a fort level 3. Get zero bonus from artillery because I have no artillery. I got all the artillery over here. I'll just bring it in. Yeah, we can just split it up here. Reorganize. Bring all the artillery in there. And attack these guys. Naso Toki. Gain the skill 2 Commandant Naso Toki in party. Is 50% cheaper. Or a general will become available for duty. Um, I, I could afford a level 2 commandant. <clears throat> Let me just check here. Uh, so I would get a skill 2 for, for half the price. Or a general. A general is worth 50 points. I think I'll take the till the commandant. And then grab him. That was a pretty good event. Come down this way. Internal conflicts in Shun. And we got a 3, 4, 1. Pretty bad. Air. We got free diplomats. Let's 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 let's. Why are the Ottoman not uh, separatists not spawning? Uh, let's put another claim on Persia. They've got noble rebels. Uh, Rough Saint John. Thank you. And back to Africa. We got that big one. Well, let's just finish it up. As much as we can. They've got two provinces over here that we can't touch. 
unless we get access through um, France, which is possible. But I don't need that extra points. Let's just take what we can <clears throat> over here. And that was the revolt I was waiting for. I got no general, that's okay, I think. Come around this way. And up there. Well, that was a tough fight, actually. Alright, let's come over here. Let's get the last couple of provinces done. Lost the claim on Marash, that's fine. I just get that one and then peace deal. Spain wants military access. Who are they fighting? Morocco? Provence, Augsburg, Saxony, the Palatinate. But yeah, sure, you can get through. Please fight Morocco. Anyway, uh, peace deal. Let's just uh, quickly do that before I stop. Uh, so the deal is I want. Um. <laughs> I just want to feed Yao and let them hand. No, actually, I want to take stuff, convert it, and then feed it to Yao. That's that was the thing I wanted to do. So currently, I have twenty percent over extension. Yeah, but these two will not count. Um, anyway, I can take about 80%. I think this is the max I can take. I would also need their money and war reparations. So I'll take this, then I'll convert it, and every time I convert a province, I will feed it back to Yao until they've got everything, and then they will core it up. That's the uh, that's the deal here. Okay, that's gonna make me very much overextended. 92% and then let's do that trick so I'm not gonna call any of that these guys will come back nice looks like we got just about half of Central Africa at this point France got some as well hopefully they will take some more stuff and I'll just finish it up over here Morocco I will attack again as soon as possible and hopefully Spain and Portugal will uh, help out we still got the Ottomans we're gonna fight them for the rest of the game I think take a bite out of them the next episode I will attack Persia as soon as I'm in position and then we really have to get into India And Brunei, as soon as possible. We're still allied with France. Passai is also a possibility. And that's going to be next time. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you later. Take care.